What up, y'all? We back again. This is Top Things. His brother just woke up from surgery and is still under the influence of anesthesia. He thought he was waking up to the music of death. She didn't choose the high life, the high life chose her and she gladly embraces it. On the flip side though, everyone's gangster until it comes to Nanny finding out. No. Yes, you are. I'm on drugs. Yes. I'm gangster. <laughs> Do anything. You cry. I'm not making you cry. Sure. Oh. You cry. Okay. Boy. <laughs> Do I talk about it? No. Did you say? I'm a gangster. What Don't you? be disappointed. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. I didn't tell anybody you were a gangster. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. That's why you told Nanny. <laughs> I didn't tell Nanny you were a gangster. That is so cute. No, uh, yeah, but it's, that's not a while. That's right. No. Hmm. More or no? Is it a drink? No. I can't. You're pushing the straw down. There you go. Mm. Good. Boy, did we thought one patient on the meds was entertaining enough. Wait until you see two of them on the juice while interacting with each other. Is here. Oh, He's drunk? Yeah. <laughs> hey. He looks a little bit more out of it than you. Did y'all hurt him? No, we didn't, didn't hurt him. him. Hold on, huh? Who's that? Brother. That's your brother? Oh. And who's this? Oh. Aww. Oh. Oh. Your brother is emotional. Oh. They cuddle. He's saying he needs them in the same chair. Oh. Is what oh, they need a cuddle? Are you feeling better now, Ira? Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't feel nothing. You don't nothing. feel nothing? No, Mom. It's just like, woo, 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 woo. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Boy. Uh. You can't feel your tongue, baby. Did they take my tongue? You can't taste your tongue. Did they take it? Did they take your tongue? No, what they didn't take your tongue. They didn't take your tongue. Your tongue's still there, baby. They didn't take it. They didn't take your tongue. Your tongue's still there. I can see your tongue. They didn't take it. You can't feel it right now, but I can still see it, though. No, they was nice people. They wouldn't take your tongue. They would leave your tongue. They just numbed it so you couldn't feel nothing. But the feeling will come back soon, okay? 
Her mom records the different phases of the anesthesia process, each with their own name and effect. Check it out. At the dentist. Who are you? I'm your mom. Hi, Ollie. <laughs> Pop, your Where son broke his wrist I? and got so put on anesthesia. Part three. Hospital? You're still at the hospital, son. Dang, I'm ready to eat. <laughs> son, Wait a second. Wait did, a second. Son, did you feel the procedure? Why do I feel so dizzy? It's son. Did you Wait, see? am I really talking or is this a dream? Son. Because I'm pretty sure this is what dreams feel like. Oh my gosh. What son. is happening to me right Let now? Let me see your pupils. What did they give you? I don't know what they gave me. <laughs> I don't know. I thought you was a doctor. Some doctor you is. <laughs> oh, I'm so embarrassed. Wow. I do. Son. Darian Isaiah. How do you feel you're going viral, son? You better turn around and look at your mom before you get a whoop it. <laughs> Whatever the doctors gave her allowed for all the strange fantasies from within to surface in the wrong place at the wrong time. Hey Rachel, what did you just tell the nurse about about what you wish it would have been instead? I wish the aliens probed my butt rather than the doctors because I've always wanted to be abducted by aliens. And uh, now I can't stop tooting, which is probably good. I mean, I wish it was aliens. It might, I mean, maybe they wouldn't put me under anesthesia. Maybe they wouldn't be so kind. I don't think you want to get butt probed by an alien. But I've always wanted to be abducted. I want to be abducted. But only by aliens. Because I, I, maybe they would slap my titties for experimentation. Like that one SNL sketch. They said it would be gentle. It would be just for gentle probing, just for science, you know. Okay. Maybe they'd give me some alien goop, and it would be the most delectable thing I've ever had. Yeah. Well, you would think if they were advanced enough to fly to Earth, they wouldn't have to butt probe people. They could just do a scan like in Star Trek. Yeah, but what if they need to take pictures of my intestines, like the colonoscopy doctor? That would be fun. Okay. Mm. His anesthesia came with a dose of attitude. Too bad for him, the meds that are supposed to help him are getting him into trouble. Seriously, why are you being so mean to me? <laughs> Drink. Are you, you want oysters still? Are you going to be nice to me? You called me 50. Cause you are. You said I have a turkey neck. Mm-hmm. But you want me to go spend money on oysters and soft shell crabs. Mm-hmm. But, um, but you're mean to me. The truth is the truth. Wow. Well, the truth is I'm gonna keep you on clear liquids. Mm. Hand me that bowl of broth and I'll smack it out your hand. I'll smack you. And I'll punch you. <laughs> you will not punch me. You want a bet? Yeah. You're gonna lose that bet. You are mean. Mm-hmm. When did you get mean? Mm-hmm. Why are you being mean? 
Mm. You got a turkey neck. I got it from you. Your mama. Mm -hmm. Stop being mean. Mm -hmm. The meds are definitely working. He's so relaxed that he thinks the hospital is paradise and he doesn't want to go home. What? Oh, dad. Okay, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, get it up. What? Get it up. Okay. Uh -huh. Wanna wake up now so we can go home? No, I'm tired of sleep. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Guess you have to stay here then. Well, yeah. I guess I'm gonna stay here. <laughs> You like it or what? Yeah, it's comfortable up in here. Okay. <laughs> you don't want to go home? Nah, I think I'm feeling good. Huh? I think I'm feeling good. Scott, you feeling good? Yeah. Well, don't get used to it. Uh, I'm used to it. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> well, we're going to be leaving pretty soon. No, say you. Dad's gonna have to carry you out. No. Can't yeah. stay here. Can't stay here. Well, I'm gonna go. Said you're gonna go home. For real? Mm hmm. Yeah. Don't be cussing. That's crazy, guys. Don't be cussing. <laughs> <laughs> Is this shit over? What? Is this shit over? I don't know what you're saying. Is this shit over? Don't cuss. Why? <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired as fuck. Don't <laughs> cuss. Stop cussing. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> you caught it open your eyes. Nah, I'm tired. Okay, let's go. Let's get out. The person whose job it is to save her apparently wanted to do the opposite according to this patient. Did you put up a fight? You did? You fought them? I wasn't there. I knew she did. I knew it. Were you fighting a doctor? But then I tell you, don't get on people a hard time. They was giving you some anesthesia to put you to sleep. <laughs> How are you going to fight the doctor and he's trying to help you? He was trying to kill me. <laughs> no, he wasn't. <laughs> he was not trying to kill you. He was trying to help you. <laughs> you ready to get dressed? They said for you to get dressed. I don't I have to work. You don't have to what? I don't have to put my clothes on. Yes, you do. We can't leave here until you do. Yes, I can. Are you going to walk out with that gown on? No. Well, then you got to put some clothes on. I can clothes on. No, you don't. I got my underwear on. You're going to walk out the hospital in your underwear? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's go then. I'm ready to go home. Life is hard, but it can be worse. This guy lost his leg, but with the help of some anesthesia and Chick-fil-A nuggets, he's gonna be just fine. Hi everybody, it's your brother Jack. I don't remember recording I this video. I got out of surgery and I got some chicken nuggets from Chick-fil-A. Woo! And I got some Chick-fil-A sauce. Ready, look, I'm gonna dip it. Take a bite. Um, my surgery went well. I think I lost my leg. Don't ask how. They said they needed to cut it off. Stuff they did. That's okay with me. Because I'm alright. Because <laughs> I only have a right leg. Um, I just want to call and say hi. I don't know where mom went, but 
Yeah, she'll be back soon. I think she went to visit her friend Sam. That's his club. Um, but I wanted to say love you, and I'll see you all soon. And goodbye. If you're showing affection to your wall and asking your cat for help, that's when you start to question if your meds are doing more harm than good. A wall cannot love you. You need to get away from the wall now and go to sit in your chair. The wall doesn't love you. No, you're going to hang on to me or something until you get to your chair. You won't... You... What? I said goodbye wall. Yeah, goodbye wall. I need some help, Sadie. I do. I said put your hand on my shoulder. No, you're too tiny. What? It's a nice table, you know. It is a nice table. It's a nice chair, too. Okay. Patients on anesthesia think that every normal question is a trick question. Wait until the end. How tall are you? Yogurt. Oh, that is. Whoa, 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 okay. <laughs> Let's get in your phone. Come on. We gotta go inside. Let's go inside, make sure you're cozy. Oh, the mouth hurts. Oh, I'm surprised the gunshot wound doesn't hurt. <laughs> Come on, Did buddy. It, it didn't go all the way through? <laughs> They took it out, right? <laughs> yes, honey. It was just where they gave you the IV where they knocked you out. It's not a gunshot wound. Are you sure? Yes, I'm positive you didn't get shot. Okay. Right. The meds caused parts of her mouth and face to swell up, looking rather fatter than usual, and she's not happy about it at all. Also, she also has some antibiotics and nausea medication yeah. in case that pain medication upsets her stomach. <laughs> I was looking at it, I was like, fat face. Is that real lit right there? This is real. Real lit. Are you saying fat face? What are you saying, Carson? Hello? Fat. Fat. So hit your face. Fat. 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 Carson, it just feels fat. It's not fat, though. Fat. Fat. Can you feel this? Oh, oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> While on the high state, she realizes that the effects of the meds can get her closer to her idols. Listen to what plans she has in mind. I'm drawing great. My neck, my lip feels the size of Jay-Z. What if I look like him? You don't. You don't. Uh, are you sure? Yeah. I know what he looks like. You don't look like him. Maybe Beyonce would like me if I looked like Jay-Z. <laughs> so I could be friends with Nicki Minaj. I don't know what it is. That'd be like the best thing ever, huh? Your arm feel Mama, better now? Look, yeah. With the next stars? I would take this bin off. You need to keep it on. Because you got a boo-boo. Yeah. No. You want to put your shirt on? Mm, yes, what's about my shirt? Okay, we'll put your shirt on. Yeah. No, so I don't put my shirt Here, how about this? She's not going to fit it. You know I got this for you the night you were born? <laughs> In the high 
At a gas station. Uh -huh. Getting the wisdom teeth removed is definitely a humbling experience, not because of the actual operation itself, but what the drugs can do to you after. I got my wisdom teeth pulled today. Oh, uh, yeah, this me. Before getting my wisdom teeth pulled. But, mom. Hey. I'm a vampire. I don't know what's wrong with me. Why did she take me over there? I swear she gets them pussy. Yeah. It's really bad. You're so fucked. I'm gonna get up out of the hospital. You're gonna keep me in the hospital all day. I'm gonna get up out of here. Mm. I'm cold. You cold? Here, hold on. I'm gonna IV. Mm -hmm. Oh, there you go. Hey! You look this so far. Like what you see? You're gonna love what we have next. Before you go, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys again on the next one.